is quite surreal to think that I haven't grown up dreaming about doing this at all. It just happened. I never would have thought I was going to the Olympics. I quite enjoy sport and now I'm Olympic champion. So, <laughs> it's a bit weird, isn't it? How old must be there? There's the embarrassing yellow tricycle there that still haunts me to this day. Um, my dad built like this carriage on the back of the tricycle so that Alex and I could both get carried along. The thing is, when you were sitting behind, everyone's pointing, going, "Oh, look at those two! You know, you're facing them. You're like, yeah, head down." <laughs> two little twins. Sitting two on little the back. twins on the back. I love these pictures of you on the like on the train or something like that. You We're look going so somewhere cheeky. like Great Ormond Street or something, aren't we? Now Alex has got no hair. She was only four when Alex was diagnosed. I don't think Victoria could have really realised just how unwell he was. I mean, you can't talk about uh, potentially your, your, your twin brother dying. But for two, three years, you know, the whole of the family's attention, you know, grandparents included, was really on Alex. I think from there on, Victoria was vying for attention, and I think that was part of... made her so competitive in everything. My dad's always been a really keen cyclist. It's kind of his way of life. I've been watching him race as long as I can remember, so it was like inevitable that when I was old enough to race a bike in some format, I would be. It's the one all-round sport. Put two cyclists together into a race. You get the pleasure from beating people. <laughs> I think we're all, we're all competitive in this world. But I want to win everything. If he wasn't able to train, he got quite upset, uptight, wasn't a happy man. Wherever he went, the bikes went too, and if the bikes didn't go, Dad didn't go. It was a big part. Yeah. Every holiday. Yeah. All the weekends. Yeah. If I said he was a pushy parent, it wouldn't be a million miles away from the truth. You know, we'd go up some really massive hill somewhere and he'd ride away from me and, and I'd think, he's not even going to look back. He's not even going to look back to see if I'm coming. That was his way of encouraging me to do it. The car's over the next hill, you have to cycle over it. The sooner you cycle over it, the sooner you can get home. The wording is character building, isn't it? That's probably the way he was schooled. You know, it was all the stick all the way. It wasn't a carrot, it was a stick. And he'd enter me for races and I'd say, oh, well, I'm going to go to somebody's birthday party into the cinema. He'd be like, oh, suit yourself. And he wouldn't really speak to me. If I didn't do it, I felt like Alex was getting more attention from my father than I was, or somebody was. And I wanted it too. You know, I wanted to have something in common with my dad. And, and cycling's the only thing, really, that I had. She was following Alex down the back straight in a sprint when Alex was already going probably as quick as he could go. She basically moved out from behind him and overtook him and moved in in probably about six lengths. She just shot past him, just shot past him. Everyone always used to say how smooth your riding was. You know, like we used to be able to see you and you'd be completely smooth, like effortless. I think you still look that way. Aww. Especially when you compare yourself to some of your competitors. And that's when he realised there was something a bit different. I thought he was just saying that because he's my dad. That's what dads do. They have to say you're brilliant. <laughs> and you go, yeah, whatever. If he hadn't have pushed me at that age, I wouldn't necessarily be here now. You know, I wouldn't have stood out from the crowd. I am grateful that it has given me this fantastic opportunity to do something well. <laughs> Somebody's written on Twitter. <laughs> Lee Lee 16. I hope that's not his age. Anyway, good God, why do I like at V Pendleton so much? Question mark. I don't even like cycling that much. If she asked me, I'd say I loved it. <laughs> 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 <laughs>